I am a happy little monkey. <laughs> I need to pick fleas off myself. I'm getting itchy. Okay, this hole is pretty awesome. You got some pretty awesome rainbows. You're playing from the awesome misty clouds. There's details and towers all over the place. It's like it takes place on top of Peach's castle in a way. It just looks like it does. There's rainbows hitting from one place to another. Um, fun fact, if you hit one of those rainbows, you go right through it, just as you would in real life. So, don't expect that those rainbows are like Rainbow Road or anything like that. At least I, at least I think they are. At least I remember that to be. Oh, this is a beautiful shot. The sky, oh, that was awesome. Um, when, when the pin is up over here, on the middle of this uh, slope here, it is next to impossible to get close to the hole. So you just gotta play on the to, towards the downhill, down, um, this portion of the tier, and then just hit uphill towards the hole and hope for the best. Yay! But since the pin is over there, there is no problem whatsoever. Next hole. What do we have for our winners? A 611 yard par 5. You aren't the winner just yet. So what are you talking about? Yeah, and I haven't won just yet, but I might as well have. Have you seen that scoreboard there? I'm way ahead of the competition. And uh, I hope I didn't hit the bunker there. But even if I, even if I quadruple bogey this hole, I'm still not going to lose this hole. Uh, for your second shot, if you got a person with a longer drive, you would have probably played it like further up, like over over there on that part of the fairway, but uh, if you got a person with a shorter drive, you're going to have to play up over here uh, for your second shot, but if you got a person with a longer drive, you'd be able to play up over there, and then you'd be able to hit to the green in two, maybe. Uh, it all depends um, how the wind is and, and how the trees are blocking you and stuff like that. It's, this is a very situational hole. But almost always you can get a birdie on it, but an eagle, no, not all the time. Okay, on a shot like this, you see how there's this like really deep spot in the green over here, like this? Uh, what you want to do is aim so the ball rolls towards the hole um, as far as you can, and I mean as far back as you can, and then top spin it towards the hole. Watch. Why would I want to do that? Because if I try and get it high, and then uh, try and backspin it to the hole, it will go all the way down. And if I try to just land it without any spin at all, uh, it'll also most likely roll back down the hill. Uh, last putt for the course, I think. Oh, I was hoping I would get that one. I was really hoping I'd get that one to finish with the birdie, but eh, 10 under power is something that I can accept. And that, my friends, is the end of the tournament. And I want my nine strokes. Wow. <laughs> that, that's not something that would happen in real life golf. That, that is, I should say, happened very often in real life golf. That would be extremely rare if that happened in real life. Oh yeah, go Diddy. Oh yeah, P Diddy. Whoopah. Pushes my nizzle. Wait a second, that's another guy. Never mind. <laughs> um, hold on just a second, please. For the last course of the game, or I should say the last main course of the game, I will be using my favorite character, Yoshi, the drug-addicted dinosaur slash dragon. And this course is epic. The most epic course in any golf game in history, at least in my opinion. Just look at this thing! Listen to the music! Fire coming out of statues, a dark overcast of clouds set along Bowser's castle. Oh, that's epic. At least I think it is. This is one of my favorite golf courses in history. Uh, I also like Peach's Castle Drones a lot, and uh, Congo Canopy, which is what I will, will be doing next, <clears throat> after the Bowser Batlands course. And you want to always hit your first ball over here, no matter what character you use. Trust me on this. 
uh, because the further you hit up the hill, the further your shot will be towards the green. And you do not have very much green to work with up here. And please don't hit short. Oh, I hit short. Don't fall down. Okay. If I were to backspin off, it would have gone off there and down near the tee boxes all over again. I would, And I would have to pretty much start this hole all over again. I'm in the heavy rough, so I better make sure this shot counts. Oh, way too much power. Uh, I think I can save par. Gotta be very careful with the shot. No, come on, no! I'm doing horrible! It's like I love to bogey the first holes today. Concentrate. Okay! I, I wasn't sure if I was gonna get that putt anyway. That would've been pretty embarrassing, actually. Oh, a little fun fact for you. If you hit a ball or look behind that front door of Bowser's Castle, you can see a pipe over there. That pipe refers to the pipe that Waluigi and Wario came out of in the intro of this game. Like, um, did you see when they came out those doors and Bowser was waiting for them to throw bomb bombs at them? Yeah, that's the pipe they came out of. Oh, by the way, see those boos? If you hit your ball through a boo, it'll knock down your ball a heck of a lot. They, they really slow your ball ball's flight down and its trajectory, everything. And this is a new uh, factor of this area here, is it, this is called wood. Who would have guessed? Yeah, they're wood planks. You can land your ball on them. They're, they are really hard, they're really fast, and if you hit one, you're almost likely to go into the water there. So I don't recommend that you hit them at any circumstances, unless you're really good at controlling your ball, or you're really good at predicting where your ball is going to go. Um, and when your ball hits one of those wood planks, you're probably not going to be able to predict where it's going to go. And I use way too much backspin for that. Because of the circumstances on this shot, I'm not going to putt it. I'm going to do a chip shot. Oh, shoot! What have I done? <laughs> I accidentally hit the button. Alright, now I'm going to putt this hole. Now, I'm just playing horrifically now. Maybe because this course is so epic, I'm just playing that badly. Come on, go in the hole, please, for Yoshi. Oh, that was horrific. Terrible. Horrendous. Amateurish. <laughs> no other words can describe it. Um, another thing I'd like to mention. Oh, yeah, baby. A new, a new lie of this is lava. Yes. Lava. And lava is just like out of bounds. Don't hit in the lava. Just like out of bounds. And you know out of bounds? Out of bounds is bad. Yeah. Um, if you if you hit in, I'll, I'll show you it later. There's something called heath. Uh, heath is basically like the flowers on the mushroom course, uh, Peach's Castle Grounds course, only even worse. So that's not something that you want to land in either. Um, it's worse than the heavy rough. Even those flowers are worse than heavy rough. If you have a person with a strong drive, you could hit over here on your first shot, and then you'd be able to hit to the green in two. Oh, but I don't have a have a character with that strong of a drive. Oh shoot! I might have to play for that spot anyway. I got myself too close to that wall. Hoopers. Um, this is quite the problem here. I'm gonna have to, I really am going to have to play it over here, and let's just see how things go. Uh, I don't want to hit too far and go into the Out of Bones lava area. I just want to put it on the fairway and see if I can hit on the green from there. Maybe I'll be able to hit on the green from there. Um, yeah, I think I'll be able to do this with a little bit of curve and a lot of luck. I should be able to get a birdie on this hole. Maybe. <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna have to see here. I'm gonna try to control it with some a lot of backspin. Um, this is not gonna control it, will it? Uh, oh, I actually did control it really well, actually. All right, I planned to do that all along. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, uphill. Definitely need the extra power for this. Come on, Yoshi. Come on, Yoshi. Come on, Yoshi. Ah! I could use that birdie, especially with how badly I played the first two holes. Woo! Mm -hmm. 